Hi guys, welcome back to In The Now. Today I am here with Marcrio. Good evening. And you're from Ruari, right? Exactly right. I'm just making sure, just, just real quick, you know, because I like to keep things in order. <laughs> uh, but anyway, uh, are you ready for your questions? Yeah, I'm all set. Okay, so first question as usual. How long have you been playing for? Uh... <laughs> <laughs> Since the very beginning, uh, G1 actually, um, oh, okay. I ended up taking a break shortly afterwards due to uh, computer complications. I came back in around uh, G... right after Eerie was introduced, actually. Oh. And I found the community be the community to be so toxic at that point. Um, not all of it, but... <laughs> no, I get it, I get it. <laughs> I remember distinctly they asked for help from a couple of people because they were transformed and, oh, they're paladins, oh, they must know what they're doing, and you get, ha-ha, noob, you did it, and it's like, oh, uh, okay, this is... Yeah, this I is mean, how it also keep in mind, you know, everybody was really young, too, oh, so... Of course, no, 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 of course, of yeah. course. I was, I was dumb, I was young and dumb at the same time. I'm still young and dumb, but... <laughs> No, no. You know, I came back, took a break, uh, a second time, and back from you know uh, G nine, mm-hmm. and then from there onward, actually. Oh, okay. All right. Uh, is there a certain memory actually on that topic that uh, that stands out to you? Like maybe uh, you had fun going to Iria for the first time, that that kind of thing. Like any any memories specifically. Um, oh man, that's a very tough one. Oh, ooh, sorry. No, it's uh, okay. There's a couple of memories that really stick out, and they, to be very honest, I, I'm not saying this to plug it, but they all involve the guild, uh, Oddblock. Um, the one you're in now. <laughs> yeah, the one I'm in now, actually, but, uh, the, the memory that really started, just to, to sum it up, is... I remember back in the day, way back in the day, most people won't remember this, but and I'm talking about back in the days of like Imana Evaporation, and that's something I pull on all new players, that if you don't know it, what Imana, ev- uh, I'm sorry, what Imana, what Mana Evaporation is, wiki it. Trust me, you're 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 going to cry. I remember Especially it. Especially if you're a mage. I remember um, it. Yeah, I was a mage back then, too. It, it, it was... And, uh, I, when I started this game, I was half melee and half magic. Instead of mm-hmm. kids, nowadays, you can do it. Back then, it was the stupidest thing you could have done, because you were as half as effective as you should have been at that total level. Very um, true. But a lot of the guilds had requirement fees in gold. What? Wait, where I don't remember they, that. You had to pay weekly. Seriously? In the, yeah, I swear to God. I remember on... You'd, I'd go through Dunbarton, and I'd see all the stones, and a lot of the stones would say, hey, weekly fee, 50,000 gold. Weekly fee, 30,000 gold. And it had these big, what big, the... big builds. And I'm like, wait, what? Yeah, no, that's me right now. Wait, wait what? <laughs> like, I need to pay gold to be what? And that, on top of a number, a n- number of uh, other mitigating factors, led me to be like, you know what? Nah, like, if I ever fall into that position of leading a guild mm-hmm. that's the farthest of the way i'm gonna yeah i feel like that's not very friendly for a guild to no like, a guild's supposed to be a team <laughs> yeah because the way i always looked at it the guild needs the members the members don't need the guild yeah um and that's that was really how oddblock was formed in with that mindset in in you, you know in thought uh or yeah however you want to say it, but, um... Yeah, I gotcha. The memories I have really are, are all tied into dumb, dumb things we've done. Uh, and, and it's always fun, nothing nothing too much of a troll. Like, mm-hmm. a big thing we're, we're famous with is, uh, is just random monster urns, because why the fuck not? <laughs> yeah. Um, pardon, pardon my... My no, it's okay. Tomorrow. You're you're allowed to swear tomorrow. on here. Don't worry. Okay. Don't worry. Oh, thank thank Jesus Christ. <laughs> <laughs> but uh, no, it's we've done a lot of eclectic things 
that uh, you know a lot of us take pride in that we're uh, I'm actually having a wedding in December and mm. I think maybe out of six six groomsmen four of them are from the guild and I met through the also, guild also like this is th like a real life wedding yeah oh wow yeah. okay yeah no me and my fiance met in college uh going on eight years this September oh, and that's really sweet it, it, uh, it was love at first sight, but I, I won't I won't bore you with any of those those details. But <laughs> this no, story it, just um, just just it just kept going. <laughs> yeah, yeah. But um, no, it, it it's it's become a real thing. Where we've had a couple of real life meetups mm -hmm. for a number of the people in the guild, um, to where we've developed a real bond. And unfortunately, it's all of us have just become a little bit. Not all of us. Some of them become a little bit stale on Mabby. Um Because yeah. you, you start playing the same game for 10 years, it starts getting a little bit like, oh, you start feeling like you have to get a walker or something. <laughs> Alright. Um, actually, uh, on on the the whole um, the fee to be in a guild thing, actually, I, I just want to say to everybody listening, uh, this this is the first time I've heard of this. If this is the first time you've heard of this, uh, just just let us know what you think, I guess, in the comments because I, I find that crazy. I don't know. I I would assume that other people have the same thoughts. Maybe it's just me, but uh, that, and if you remember I, it, also comment. Just just comment in general on that. Yeah, topic. so maybe do I, it. I don't feel like a you know a, maybe a, oh I maybe I just I wasn't dreaming that or something like because I remember. That was back when you couldn't swing a dead cat without hitting a guild stone. Yeah, I just, of I'm just curious. Like, I'm actually just curious. I want to see how many people uh, remember that kind of thing. I don't know. It's going to be kind of embarrassing if nobody comments, though. But... No, I mean, <laughs> it, 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 it's one of those things where, like, I, I'll, I'll remember... Uh... How long have you been playing it, if I'm asking? Uh, since the first day of Iria. Very first day of Iria. Okay, so then you're familiar with the Families Guild, correct? Uh, or with no, the name no, no, because I mean, I was, uh, I was in Tarlatch. Oh Jesus! Okay, All right. <laughs> yeah. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I'm, I'm having one of those moments where my <laughs> my familiarity is getting in bed in me. I'm sorry. It's okay. Uh, should we just go on to the next question? I, it's yeah, like seven I'm minutes sorry. in. <laughs> seven I, I, minutes I'll in, we haven't right. gotten any other questions. I'll preserve my uh, my. my... <laughs> My sanity a little bit, I'm sorry. <laughs> it's okay. I liked the story, it's okay. Uh, shorter question. Um, or I guess a shorter question with a shorter answer. Uh, favorite color? <laughs> red. Red okay. and white. Like, a, like the neon red that you have on? Yeah. Alright, gotcha, gotcha, gotcha. <laughs> Do you have any names that you'll always remember? If the game were to, you know, poof. Um... Yeah, uh, and too many to, to list right now. To oh, be okay, fair. I, that's fine. <laughs> that's fine. Um, at least we know there's there's a ton of names that you'll always remember. <laughs> uh, do you have any other hobbies outside of Mabinogi? Uh, yeah, I am a uh, fisherman. Um, oh, that's interesting. Uh, that and uh, I'd say amateur gardener. But uh, that, that's, that's neither here nor there. <laughs> well, that's really interesting, though, and, and a good combination, I would say. Thank of, you. Of other hobbies outside of Mabinogi. <laughs> uh, so, do you have any pets at home? Uh, I do not have the pet. Uh, it's my um, my my fiance's Chihuahua. Uh, oh, okay. It. Uh, I have nothing against it. I love the dog. I really do. But it's not my pet. You know yeah, I mean? yeah, um, I gotcha, I gotcha. I used to have cats, but I had uh, four cats back, back about just over eight years ago. But unfortunately, my mother had a stroke at that point in time. And oh, I see. That really sucks. I'm an only child. No, that's right. And I, I, no one was able to, to really take care of that many cats. Mm -hmm. And I was able to rehome them all successfully. But Oh, that's good. Um, it... it it was a very good Tough life time. lesson. 
Well, yeah, um, it, it yeah. was, but it's, it was a very good life lesson, and I implore everyone to at least understand that if you're thinking about getting an animal, please keep in mind that if you are the only one that is able to take care of that animal, God forbid, knock on wood, something were to happen to you, mm-hmm. what is going to happen to that animal? Yeah, exactly. And that's exactly. something I didn't think about as a, as a kid. Four cats, that's that's a little bit excessive when it's just yeah. one... I'm being very honest for myself, looking back on it, and it's like, mm-hmm. okay, wait a second. I loved all four. I took very good care of all four, but that's it was too not much. exactly yeah. exactly. It, God forbid something were to happen like it did, then you have all that additional emotional stress. Yeah, which again was not needed at the time, but it, it's a good life lesson to know for the future. Yeah, of course. I mean, hey, I I think that's good advice. I think we should take that as. Uh, the advice that I usually ask at the end of the video. <laughs> that's that's a good one. <laughs> um, do you actually have a favorite animal? On that note. Ah. Uh, shit, that's a really good question. Um, Haven't really thought about it before? Uh, it, it's one of those things where it's like, you know, if you asked me as a kid, I would have said turtle. In a heartbeat, um, you like turtles. <laughs> oh yeah, I had I had I had tortoises growing up as well. Oh, that's um, really cool. Oh yeah, I, I've loved love animals. I've had uh, lab rats, tortoises, hermit crabs. Uh, oh, I always wanted hermit crabs when I was little, oh, but I never they're got fun. one. <laughs> they're fun. Um, cats. Uh, what else did I have? Uh, frogs. A little, little bit of everything. So that that's. So just so in general, like, you you love animals. Yeah, I really do. I, I I can't really say, oh, I love this animal. If there's one, okay, I'll be straight. Mm-hmm. Love octopuses as long as they remain in the fucking tank, <laughs> um, and keep me the fuck away from jellyfish. I'm sorry. That that's one I cannot. <laughs> I I just can't. I'm sorry. It no, is a okay. fish. Everyone has that one fisherman. animal that they 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 kind of stray away from. Oh no! I, I can hear fishermen right now just laughing their asses off at me. Oh, he's afraid of uh, no, dude. Yo, mm, mm, mm. <laughs> uh. All right. Uh, do you have a dream job, or maybe you're uh, already doing your dream job? Who knows? Uh, I do have a dream job. My dream career, and I always gotta laugh that whenever I say it, is in all seriousness, is a professional wrestler. Oh. Uh, I unfortunately, from the time I was in high school, my father was in very poor health, mm-hmm. uh, and, and now, of course, my mother had was in very poor health. And it's just in the last year and a half, I've been able to actually get detached from that, for lack of a better term. I'm still in constant communication, but certain times you have to live in a different environment, so you can grow and not really I don't want to say be hindered but are Mm -hmm. afforded the most opportunities and with that being said I'm I'm working currently in construction yeah uh and in also in sanitation in New York City so that's that's it's fun I'm not gonna say it's not yeah but at some point I would like to try to step into the squared circle yeah of course I mean, that's the whole point of the question, right? I mean, maybe <laughs> maybe you're not doing what you would have dreamed to do. No, but, of course. But it's good to know what, what, what kind of dreams you do have. Maybe other people share the same dreams, who knows? Um, do you have a favorite piece of gear? I would have to say probably active or non-active. Uh, if you don't mind me it doesn't matter. It doesn't matter to me. And like, if it's a fashion item as well, that's fine too. Yeah. Okay. I, if it's a, you know what? I, I'd have to say it's a tie between um, a fashion item and actually an a item I don't use anymore. Okay. Uh, one being a par ice wand. Whoops! And I forgot I used a weapon appearance scroll on this. Well, it's okay. That's so my favorite that. weapon appearance. Fox <laughs> wand, so great. <laughs> and then the fashion item would have been my dragon crest, simply oh, because yes. 
for a very long time. I'm talking about from generation nine. That's what you're known for having. Yeah. From generation nine to like 15 plus, I didn't take this off. I didn't open the helm. Nobody knew. My guild members for two years did not know what I looked like on purpose. Mm -hmm. And I made it this big reveal one time where I just took the helm off and it was like, oh shit, he has a face. Yeah, I mean, people drew you with it. (laughs) Yeah, yeah, for a very long time, I was known to... I was actually thinking about wearing that... that, Because it got even to the point where, hey, I had to go with my color scheme. (laughs) That's funny. But um, you, you can't find him anymore. I remember back in the day, you used to be able to buy a Dragon Crest in every shop for 600k. Wait, like, the, you, you really can't find them? Like, are they... No. Are they not, uh, like, an NPC the, shop kind of thing, or...? As far as I know... And I would have I, to look course, at the wiki again for that. Jeez. I could be wrong, but I think it was a gotcha item. Huh. Um, and back then, it, it was just... The rate was so freaking high. That you could get them all time, or at least no one wore them, as far as I know. But I, at the same time, I remember I would see them in all colors: blue, gold, yellow, orange. Yeah, I, I, I remember seeing them all the time too, actually. And that's one of those items. That's like a like a um a ring mail armor. You don't use that. You can get them from NPC shop, but I never see them worn anymore. Hmm. Okay. Well. <laughs> Uh, since it's going past the 16 minute mark, um, I hate to end it here, I know, because I haven't asked too many questions, but we did, we did go on a little bit at, at the start, but I don't know, I, I like it when people go on like that, it, it shows more of a different side of them, so, um, if you guys have more questions for him, like, if, if you happen to want to know more about him, uh, I'm sure he's okay with you, uh, asking him those questions? <laughs> Pretty, More than okay. You know, seems pretty friendly, willing to make friends. I, I would assume. <laughs> oh yes. So, or maybe even uh, I guess if if you want to comment as well the questions that you wanted to know, then uh, maybe maybe that would be a good idea. But <laughs> anyway, uh, so that is all for uh, for this in the now. Uh, thank you for doing this with me. Of course. Thank you so much for having me. I will see you all in the next, in the now. Goodbye.